today we're heading out on a wonderful hike in Redwood National Park. Join me as we explore Lady Bird Johnson Grove. You can really see and feel the difference between old and new growth forest. It's magical to cross the bridge and enter the area of the redwoods that escaped being logged. Just past the trailhead, you can download a virtual walking tour of this particular trail and enjoy some interesting information on the history of these trees and the local flora and fauna. In October of 1968, Redwood was established as a national park. And then in August of 1969, then President Nixon dedicated the Lady Bird Johnson Grove to the former first lady and environmental activist for her incredible conservation work. You'll want to make sure to stop at the dedication spot where you can read more about the history of this area and enjoy the trees while relaxing on one of the benches. It's believed that only about 5% of the world's old growth redwood forests remain after extreme logging, and half of that is found here inside Redwood National Park. It's fascinating to see the fallen and the burned out trees along with the healthy and growing redwoods here. This grove is rare in that it sits nearly 1200 feet above sea level. Along with frequent fog, the wet conditions and extra rain received at the higher elevations here make the color of these redwoods look unique and slightly less red than those found at lower elevations.
The average age of an old growth redwood is in between five and 700 years old. However, some will live well past a thousand years and reach over 350 feet tall. It's pretty incredible to think that some of these trees are the length of a football field. I find this trail to be incredibly special because one moment you're walking through a second growth forest and the next you find yourself in the old growth redwood forest as the one and a half mile trail weaves along the old logging road. For added hiking in this area, you can connect the three mile Berry Glen Trail to the one mile Lady Bird Johnson Grove. It always amazes me to think how these old redwoods can take hundreds, if not thousands of years to decompose after they've fallen, and even then, they're still giving new life. To protect the forest, make sure to stay on the developed trail as venturing off the path can cause significant damage here and always follow the leave no trace principles to leave these special spots safe and intact for generations to come. Thanks so much for joining me today here in Redwood National Park. For more information about this spot, see my full Lady Bird Johnson blog post at flyingdonnery.com. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button and subscribe. And until next week, I hope you find adventure and encouragement wherever you go. Bye.